a Turkish gold trader testifying in a politically charged case over Iran sanctions sodomized his cellmate with a cucumber and repeatedly raped him, a new lawsuit charges. Reza Zarab sexually assaulted Fauzi Jaber, who pleaded guilty in July to trafficking guns and drugs to FARC revolutionaries in Colombia, while the two were cellmates at the Metropolitan Correctional Center between November 2016 and March 10, 2017, according to Jaber's suit. The parties lived together locked for much of the time in a small cell which became a kind of torture chamber, Jaber's suit filed Thursday in Manhattan Supreme Court states. Zarab, 34, ingratiated himself with Jaber, 62, of the Ivory Coast before beginning his assaults, the suit says. Zarab, a wealthy Turkish Iranian playboy, pleaded guilty to money laundering and other charges in October and agreed to cooperate with federal prosecutors in a case that has rocked the highest levels of Turkish politics. Zarab hired a private lawyer for Jaber and in September the 2016 put money in Jaber's commissary account, the suit says. Zarab also wired money to Jaber's family in Africa, the suit says. Zarab, through his power at the jail, arranged to have Jaber moved into his cell, according to papers. Once they were cellmates, Zarab started telling plaintiff that he likes having sex with both men and women, Jaber's suit reads. In November, Zarab anally raped Jaber, according to the suit. Because the two men were alone in the locked cell Jaber felt helpless and unable to fight off the younger and stronger Zarab, the suit says. In January, Zarab bragged he had bribed a Bureau of Prisons employee $4,000 so both men would be moved to a wing of the prison with cells that afforded more privacy, Jaber charges. In March, Zarab attacked Jaber with a cucumber, causing bleeding, the suit says. Shortly after the attack Zarab was moved out of Jaber's cell and is now in an undisclosed location while he cooperates with the feds. Zarab's testimony in the ongoing case will likely will win him leniency against charges that could carry a prison term of up to 130 years. U.S. authorities arrested Zarab in March 2016 when he entered the United States with his wife, daughter and four other people for a trip to Disney World. Zarab was charged in a plot to help Iran avoid U.S. economic sanctions and flood financial institutions with $1 billion of oil revenue. Zarab is testifying against Turkish banker Mehmet Hakan Attila. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan said Tuesday that the trial is a conspiracy to blemish the country. Zarab's lawyer, Benjamin Brafman, denied the charges. With Victoria Beke MPs.